A day after Ramadan, households feast, but in the home of Hudu, family mourn. The night of Monday, 2nd May, will be the last time he sets his eyes on his wife. I was with my wife all night. He tested her sugar level. I paid 10 Ghana cities for every test run on her. I ended up paying 180 cities. They refused to give me a receipt. I was given a prescription. I thought it was drug, not knowing it was a glucometer. When I returned, there was nobody around my wife. When I inquired from the nurse, she told me she can no longer run the test on my wife since I have bought my own glucometer. Hudu is here to overcome the passing of her wife, whom he had four children with. Hudu is still going through that pain, and uh, it has really become very, very difficult for him to overcome. A week ago, her late wife renewed her national health insurance with her Ghana card, but he was told the card was not active to take care of his wife's medical cost. Menshia Government Hospital has denied any wrongdoing when it comes to negligence. That did not happen according to the medical superintendent here. But the issue of paying money for a test run to determine the sugar level of a patient is unconventional. Yes, uh, that is the allegation that is raised, and we are going to investigate that one to find out the allegation. It is not a convention as far as it this particular. Not, it is not a convention. It is not okay. a convention. Okay. Especially if the person doesn't have uh, insurance, normally we will we'll bill you, put it down, and then give you your bill that maybe this is the amount of money that you are owing before the person is discharged.